What's up everybody? Welcome back to New York Reacts. Today we're going to be checking out something a little bit different on my channel that I've done a little bit of stuff on this and basically this is new tech that's come out of Nvidia and it's called Nerf and from what I understand these are 2D images that you can take and the software will then try to stitch them together creating a, basically a fake 3D version of it. So let's take a look shall we? In a three, a two, a one. Okay. See? So taking 2D photos and making them into 3D scenes in second. <clears throat> First of all, hold on. I'm shocked right from the get-go that they're about to take those four images and make a 3D scene out of it. Normally, you need, you know, you need to at least take a left, a right. The, those images look like almost the same. There was only a couple different angles. They weren't a lot of images. Four. Four shots. Okay, in my experience, like, when we, when I worked on um, Red Dead Redemption 2, um, I did photogrammetry for it when we very first started the project and we were taking photos of all these uh, things that we're going to replicate in the game using photogrammetry, which is very similar to this. Now, when I was out there taking photos, you can't just take a couple photos. It's not going to know how to make that in 3D. You have to take as many as possible. You go boom, 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 boom. You take photos like all around the object on every single thing you can think of and then you spit it into the software and it, it does a pretty pretty good job of it and then even afterwards you had to like clean up all the geometry and the topology in another program so if this can do this in four four photos call me impressed <laughs> Now, that may look sort of good from what it shows here, but I would like to see the 3D mesh, the, the actual geometry and topology that it's creating, because it's probably a giant mess, and the textures that it's doing as well don't look that good. They look, they look flat and, and sort of dull, depending on the picture, and it, it all depends on the camera you use. So, if you have a really good, like, Hasselblad or something that takes really, like, high-resolution images, that's the best you can do for this type of scenario. So, let me know what you guys think about this stuff. This is some of these technology. Some of this technology is getting wild, and it's becoming just <laughs> unreal. Because in the past, we we thought that like you know like five or ten years ago, we thought this stuff was going to be way in the future, and it's creeping up. It's coming sooner and sooner and sooner. And like when you see those deep fake videos, that stuff is wild. That deep fake stuff is almost there. The Tom Cruise and. <laughs> Pretty crazy. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. I want to know if you're an animator, a 3D artist, and, and what you think of this stuff. And if you're involved in it, like if any of you guys have done photogrammetry, let me know. Um, so, pretty cool. Uh, if you are still here, looks like you're enjoying the content, check out my other stuff. You can stay, have a good laugh. I really appreciate you coming by and spending your time with me for the day. So, uh, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace!